Are you ready to decode the silent signals of distress? In this video, gain insight into pediatric eating disorders, enhancing your skills to identify, understand, and intervene effectively. Let's discuss anorexia nervosa and ARFID, avoidant restrictive food intake disorder. While anorexia is characterized by severe caloric restriction due to body image distortion, ARFID differs significantly. Children with ARFID may avoid eating due to fears of choking or pain or due to sensory aversions, like an inability to tolerate crunchy textures or mixed foods. These children often lack interest in food and can go hours without feeling hungry. Early detection is key. Look for signs such as failure to gain expected weight or unexpected weight loss, particularly if these changes deviate from their growth curves. Initiate discussions by observing visible changes. Questions about meal skipping, dieting trends among young children, and their understanding of body image are crucial. Remember, even young children, like those in elementary school, might engage in dieting behaviors. While eating disorders are often highlighted in females, it's imperative to recognize that males are equally at risk. Their symptoms might be less obvious or expressed differently. In the digital age, social media plays a significant role in shaping body image. Be aware of online communities that promote unhealthy eating habits and unrealistic body standards. Treatment varies by disorder. Regular medical follow-ups are critical, especially for anorexia, where close monitoring of nutritional intake and physical activity adjustment is needed. Caloric intake adjustments should be tailored based on individual energy deficits. Some adolescents may require upwards of 4,000 to 5,000 calories daily if they are particularly active or tall. Building a trusting relationship with patients and their families is crucial for successful management. Your clinical intuition is invaluable. If you suspect an issue, it's likely there. Follow through with comprehensive assessments and tailored interventions. Together, we can illuminate the path to healing and empower every child to thrive.